Here recently I had talked about how these supersonic bombers were sent toward Venezuela. Now there's talk of Vladimir Putin and Venezuela reaching an agreement where they can send these to a base in the Caribbean and they're going to be used as a refueling station. Now, anytime you see another country start to set up in an area like this, it's worth making note that they're doing so. This is obviously a big power here around the globe when it comes to Russia, opposite of us here on this world stage. They have a lot of weaponry, they have subs, and they've sailed their ships several times into Cuba, around the Gulf of Mexico, and setting up in the Caribbean would give them a strategic advantage. Regardless of if it was a full-blown base or if it was just, like they're trying to say here, for refueling. Meaning that they won't have to do aerial refueling anymore. They do any missions to the United States. And they state that they would have to return back to base after doing these missions because Venezuelan law does not allow for any foreign nation to be able to come into their country and establish a military base. So they're utilizing this island that Venezuela controls in the Caribbean, and they're going to let them land there to refuel. So strategically, that's big time for Vladimir Putin and Russia in making a move like this, and they're using what is known as the White Swans. We can see how they get that name by looking at the design. But I wanted to make mention of it. I'm going to leave a link here with more information. Make sure to follow me on Twitter for more. Much love.